Hello and welcome back to episode 35 of the 100 Baby Challenge. Yes, I have been wearing the same things for the last episodes. That's because I filmed them all today. I filmed them all today because I took a break today of streaming. So I had a lot of time on my hands, so I'm getting ahead. So it's been about an hour since I filmed the last one. I took a lunch break. But we have a lot going on. Everyone's just having a bad day. Everyone needs their needs filled. Juniper is pregnant. That's all you need to know. That's all you need to know. Let's go into the game. Okay, Juniper is starving. So get leftovers and then go to sleep. Also, we need to get Tomati. I think that's his name. We got to get him out. He's got to leave. Autumn here needs to go to the bathroom. Have you? Are you ready for school? No, you need to get a skill to level three. So you have fitness, so you're going to dream big. How are you? You also need to go to the bathroom. And you have no skills. Uh, Cook, fill up our fridge. Wait, it's Friday. So they don't need to worry about skills right now. They can just go to bed. Go to sleep. Oh, and then the, the tots, the tots. Tots are hungry. You also need to go potty. And then what skills do you need? Communication, movement, potty, and thinking. Okay. You can work on communication and then you can go to sleep. What do you need? You're good on food. You're technically asleep. Um, But you need creativity. So what if you play inside the tent instead of sleep in it? Use the toilet, please. And then go to sleep. And then you come use the toilet and then you can go back to sleep. All right, we got imagination skill going. Good job. All right, that's imagination level three. We gotta work on movement, potty, and thinking. So what if you come work on movement over here? Cause you can't do potty cause your mom's asleep and everyone else, everyone's asleep. Are you waking up your sisters? Back to sleep. Stop having a temper tantrum and go to bed. Go to sleep. And you're running through there a little bit, and then you're gonna come to bed. Oh, oh Juniper, your child. Supervision baby care. And then come take care of this one too while you're here. While you're awake, why don't you clean out spoiled food? Because your energy's pretty good. And then you can resume your song. Resume your song. All right, my cat's on my lap now, so see his tail. Why? Juniper spotlight is fading. Juniper. That's okay. She doesn't need to be celebrity. Love day was pretty good. Oh, good. And love is awful for the girls, obviously, because they were home the entire day. You need to go potty. Juniper, stop this, and then potty train mary i feel like middle of the night is a great time for potty training level two potty heck yeah all right summer's awake she needs to go to the bathroom and she needs some food are you gonna go bye buddy oh there's his tail is there no leftovers all right you can come learn how to cook <gasps> are you okay he just yeeted himself onto the floor juniper did i tell you that you could uh play on the computer no you're supposed to be writing music where did you get a dance floor all right autumn's awake autumn's hungry you can come eat this Oh no, you're lactose intolerant. Why? Don't eat cheese. You're gonna be so stinky. You need to take a shower. You have the fitness skill, so why don't you come dream big? Oh, the Todds are awake. Have a grilled cheese. Grab a grilled cheese. Why aren't you eating your grilled cheese? Eat your grilled cheese. Oh, cook in the level three, look at her go. And when you're done with that, you're gonna, you are gonna work on communication. And then you have to work on movement, potty, and thinking. So how about potty? All right, you got fitness level three, good job. All right, both of them are ready for school, so they can do whatever they want. Do you have extra credit? You do. You both do. Good job. Juniper's almost on another song. Okay, let's call this one 100 Baby Bops. You know, that can be viewed as very, uh, like, not great. It's fine. Bops is a, like, good song, you know? All right, another one. Do a relaxed rhythm. I don't know what we already did. Oh, maybe not. Supervision Baby Care. And then write a song. Do, actually, you know what? Do a plucky tune. That's communication level two for you. And when you're done, you can go potty. Can you take care of this baby? Communication level three! Oh no. Nope, it's just some congratulations. Oh, we got our royalties today. Good job. Way to go, Juniper. You are gonna like pass out. Go to sleep. Can you clean up? <gasps> Dorothy got potty level three. Good job, Dorothy. All right, stop, 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 stop. What else do we need? Movement and thinking. So what if you just like walk around and watch your sister while she does stuff? You need to take a shower. Go take a shower. Why don't you come clean these up? Polish to perfection. And then mop like mad. And then polish this one. And then you can enter the trash. Otis, yeah, Otis can come over. All right, you're gonna wake up now. And you're going to go potty. And then you're gonna watch. You're gonna watch your family. <gasps> Dorothy got thinking level three. Good job, Dorothy. Now go play outside. Play in your tunnels. Potty level three, good job. Movement, there's movement level three. So you just need thinking. And how are you? You're still working on movement. Hey, I got your special gift because you're such a good neighbor and I appreciate your kindness and friendship. Wanna see what it is? Oh, Brent's brought us a, a gift. Why are you uncomfortable from working out? Then stop working out. Okay, leftovers. How are your skills? You're at all level three, so come to sleep. You still gotta wait for your sister to get to th up thinking. I'm gonna queue up a bunch and I'm hoping if we wake her up in a few minutes, having these queued up will be enough. 
Okay, wake up. Okay, Juniper, I got you. I need you to wake up and get yourself some food. All right, you're so close. Yes, level three. Okay, let's age these two up. Juniper, help blow out candles for Dorothy. Actually, Dorothy's asleep right now, so you can help blow out candles for Mary and we'll wake up Dorothy. All right, add candles. All right, so Dorothy's aged up and she's good. She's outgoing, cute, and she's gonna be social. Love that for her. And then help blow out candles for Mary. You need to fix your needs. So get leftovers and then go to sleep. Actually, you're really sad. So what if you go cry it out a little bit? Uh, Juniper, come on. No, uh, stop this. Uh, the cake went bad. Go to sleep. Juniper, uh, can you make a new cake? Uh, I can't believe the cake went bad. I'm so offended. All right, the cake is almost done. Juniper, don't put it over there. Bring it over here. Add candles. Wake up. I'll blow out candles for Mary. Mary's aged up. She's good. Okay, and she's gonna be creative. Okay, you are gonna die of hunger soon. So get some leftovers really fast. Take a shower or use the bathroom and then you can go to sleep. I think I might get rid of the, sh the tub shower because we don't bathe our toddlers. They're not toddlers long enough to need bathed. So I think I might swap it out for a normal shower. Okay, you know what? We're gonna do a little bit of a bathroom makeover really fast. <gasps> we have two showers now. Go take a shower. Juniper, why don't you change the AC so it's not hot in here? You're tired, go to sleep. We finally have two showers. I don't know why I didn't do that sooner. It would have made a lot more sense earlier, but it's fine. You're still sad. You need fun. Come watch TV. Are you guys ready for school? No, you didn't even do your homework. Do your homework. It's literally Sunday. You gotta do your homework. We got their skills up. So you're a creative, so you can do creativity. Isn't there a vi Yeah, pra practice the violin. And you're a social butterfly. Okay, you can chat in a kid's chat room. Resume your book and then go to the bathroom. Why don't you come clean up this? Dorothy's finished her homework. Good job, Dorothy. Get onto your skill and then you can get some leftovers. Oh, Juniper is gonna pee her pants. Don't pee your pants. Mary's finished her homework. Good job, Mary. Oh, she's got level two creativity. Heck yeah. The Festival of Youth has started. Should we go to the Festival of Youth? Should we take them all to the Festival of Youth? That could be fun. They're all ready for school. Go to the Festival of Youth. Everyone's here. Let's go to the festival. Why don't you guys come talk to Yamachan and join the Void Cutter Hunt? And then I'm gonna see if we can find any eligible bachelors for Juniper. Oh, you're an elder. Okay. Check for void critters. Oh, you already found one. Look at you go. Check for void critters. Juniper. Why are there only elders? What's all the elders at the festival of youth? Go take a selfie with Yamachan. Okay. Is there any way to like seduce Yamachan? He doesn't even have a name. I'll be honest. I don't know if that's how you spell Yamachan, but it's Yamachan, Yamachan. And we're gonna try to have his baby. I think so. I think that's gonna ha be how it is. See here? No. I wanna. I wanna seduce Yamachan. You need to go to the bathroom. Where are the bathrooms? Where are the bathrooms? Go over here. What's with all the elders for Juniper? No one's doing great right now. All right, everyone's really uncomfortable right now. Who are you? You're a young adult, or you're you're not an elder. You're not an elder. You're bald, but you're not an elder. Sorry, Yamachan. Attempt to seduce. Okay, everyone's having a not great time right now, so we're just gonna go home. Unfortunately, we failed seducing Yamachan. Unfortunately. I really wish we could have a Yamachan baby. But sadly, we can't even be friends with him, which I find really dumb. All right, one of the babies is upset. Sheldon, you're good. You could use some food, but it's fine. You come get some leftovers and watch TV. You, you need to take a shower. Dance skill acquired. And then Juniper, go to sleep. And then what's your skill social? Why don't you talk to your sister? You also need to go to the bathroom. And what's your skill? Creativity. You can just play the violin some more. Where is the violin? Oh, it's in your hand or it's in your bag. Okay. Oh, it's the twins birthday. What trimester is Juniper in? She's almost in her third trimester. All right, we got level three mode or level three social and almost level four. There's level four, perfect. How about creativity? What are we at? Level three, okay. Juniper, wake up before you pee your pants. And then you need a nap, as do you. And then why don't you get some leftovers? And how much food's in our fridge? Because I might have one of the girls fill it. Oh, there's like nothing. There's just salad. Can you please come cook something? Fruit salad. Fruit salad seems like a great thing to cook. 
I'm gonna make some rice cakes too, that works. Juniper, what's going on? You're hungry? Did you get leftovers? There's salad in there. You're almost at level four, you're almost at level four. Cooking level six? All right, we're filling. We got level four. Why is Vlad here? We've already had your baby. Get out. Send him home. And then Juniper, why don't you continue working on one of your songs? And let's also put up these birth certificates. Wait, a bunch of my birth certificates are gone. No, they're not. Why is there just an empty wall? <gasps> That's where the door was. And I removed the door so we can put our birth certificates over here. Oh, I just panicked because I thought I lost all of my birth certificates. Oh, look, we have so much more space now. I love everyone just playing their music together. Can you clean the cabinets? Counters, not cabinets. We don't have cabinets, do we? Yeah, we don't have any cabinets. Oh, you're level five. You can stop. Go to bed. Go to bed. Does anyone have extra credit to do? You have extra credit to do. And you do not. Juniper, you're going to pee your pants. You're going to pee your pants. Okay, good. And then go work on your stuff again. And we'll clean up the inventory. This is literally so much stuff. Stop sending my kids presents. Summer's finished her extra credit. Good job, Summer. How right, are you guys? Go take a shower. Oh, don't take a steamy shower. No, don't take a steamy shower. Take a brisk shower. You take care of the baby. Stop playing with the baby. All right, school starts in an hour for all four of them. Where's Juniper Pratt in her pregnancy? Oh, she's in her third trimester. She might give birth today. All right, the kids are out of school. Have a great day at school. It's just Juniper and the babies. Right on cue. And why don't you finish your song? Average out. Summer's last math test was not her best work. She got a so-so grade, which could really bring down her average. Should she ask to do some extra credit or just try harder to get a perfect grade next time? Extra credit. Summer's teacher lets her do some extra problems. The teacher would rather see her understand the concepts a little bit later than not at all. She gratefully completes the work and earns a few extra points on her grade. Good job. All right, Juniper's almost done with this last song that she needs. Did she lose her celebrity level? She lost her celebrity level. That's okay. Can you please finish your song? Oh, you're not that close, actually. Go to the bathroom first. Why are you gonna start crying as soon as I'm playing my tunes? I think they're gonna age up soon. You have to pee again? She's gonna give birth anytime now. We might have a bunch of babies. These teens better age up today. These teens better age up today because this baby will be the eighth baby in the house. Like it'll be the eighth person in the house and we can't let Juniper age up. So these girls better age up today. <gasps> we finished the milestone. Okay, a um, hundred baby blues. All right, Juniper, what else do we need? Spent 75 hours playing musical instruments and mentor others in music. So what if you just go practice your instrument for a little while? And then we'll mentor the next two when they're teens. <gasps> they're home. Autumn has an A, Summer has an A, Dorothy has a B, and Mary has a B. <gasps> Perfect. And we still don't have the baby yet, so we could have multiples. Both the candle. And then you two start on your homework. All right, Autumn's aged up and she's, oh, family oriented. Love that. Who's calling you? You're about to age up. No, you can't talk to your brother. You're gonna age up. Blow out candles. Summer's aged up and she's a glutton. She's a glutton and lactose intolerant. That's gonna be awkward for her. Okay, let's go move them out. Okay, these two are gonna go live in Tartosa with their other siblings. Perfect. Okay, now to focus on these two. Why don't you help them with their homework? Help with homework. I wanna see how that does. Oh no, someone else died. Hayes, Hayes died. Not Hayes. I can't believe Hayes is dead. Ah. They've aged up. Sheldon is a charmer, cute. Genesis is fussy. Oh, okay, but you are done with your homework but you need to get some food and go to the bathroom and then do your extra credit and then work on your project. You're not hungry, so you can be potty trained first. All right, Juniper, stop with the homework. Juniper, go potty train. Casey's calling. Quick question, Lola Walsh and I are planning to spend some casual friend time together. Should I do it? Yeah, go hang out with your sister. All right, you are gonna come over here and watch your sibling go potty. Watch Sheldon go potty. Oh, right, Juniper, you need to go to the bathroom. Juniper, go to the bathroom. But did that say potty level two? No, just potty level one. Okay. All right, keep watching him. Sheldon, can I use a potty chair? Sheldon, go level two potty already. Good job, Sheldon. You can go potty on your own now. And then come get some fruit salad. And then Juniper's asleep. You work on communication. Dorothy's finished her extra credit. Good job, Dorothy. Genesis got level two communication. You're almost to level three. And then why don't you go watch your sisters? Yeah, level three communication. All right, go do some watching and you're getting food, and then you're gonna do communication. Yeah, I know you're sad, I'm sorry. Juniper's in labor! Juniper! Have you been hospital? All right, Juniper. She's learned that her doctor's a doctor. I love that. I'm really glad that her doctor is a doctor. Otherwise, I'd be very concerned. 
All right, Juniper. It's a boy. Darwin. That's cute. Two boys. Steve. I don't think we've used Steve yet. We're going with Steve. All right. Let's go home. We have to. We're gonna get Juniper pregnant, and then we're gonna end the episode. I'm gonna get her pregnant. I wish we could be. Uh, I wish we could have a baby with Yamachan. I'm still upset about that. All right, super efficient baby care them. And I'll figure out how to invite over. Oh, Jimmy's married. I'm not opposed. Jimmy, come on over. Okay, how are you? You ready for school? Did you finish your project? You're hungry. Get some leftovers. Did you finish your project? Yes, Mary did do her school project. Okay. Why don't you help your sister with her project? Why are you crying? Why don't you go play? Why don't you both go play? Okay. Exchange numbers. Beguile him. Juniper, did you, did you beguile? Beguile. Look at him. Exchange numbers. Compliment his appearance. Oh my gosh, what if? Our babies are bald. If we have babies together, and what if they're bald? Can I smooth talk him? First kiss, first kiss, first kiss! Oh no, Steve is hungry. Feed Steve and then see if he wants to woohoo with you. There we go, now we can track for a baby. Track for a baby with Jimmy. All right, good, they're, they're gonna track for a baby. Can you come help your sister with her project? There we go, finish your project, do extra credit. You need to go take care of yourself. Go take a shower, get some leftovers, watch TV while you do that, and then go to sleep. Juniper, take her pregnancy test. She's eating for two! Juniper the baby, Juniper the baby. Take care of your baby. Okay, Juniper's pregnant. The kids are basically ready for school. We're gonna end the episode there. It's gonna be chaotic to start the next episode when I get to filming them eventually, but it is what it is. So we've, we're like cranking out these babies. We're at like 55 or something like that. Maybe, I think this is 57 now with these two new twins, which is wild. We only just hit 50 like a few episodes ago. So to have 57 already, so many twins is just absurd. Please leave a comment down below of baby name suggestions. I'm running out of names, so I'd love to get some suggestions from you guys, see what you, we should name the babies. Also, if you want to submit a baby daddy for the challenge, go ahead and put it up on the gallery with the hashtag Dizzy Daddies, and I'll be happy to look at them and add them to my game. Thank you so much for watching. Be sure to like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time.